Yep. Cool. Butter? Yeah. Cheers, bro. See that, buddy. No, I'll piss it up. Down. Yeah, yeah. Do that side as well. And that way. Then. I can't see shit out of them anyway. I don't know what's the point. In shitty mirrors. See more out of this little dinky thing. Alright guys, sorry about the camera quality, I've got my old GoPro on because the other one ran out of battery so I forgot to charge it because uh, we had some other issues. Um, yeah we had some other issues. GoPro in, it was meant to be the foot cam. Well, actually, I had a setup to view the rear, so unfortunately, I haven't got anything but one cam, and it's not quite HD or HD HD because uh, qualifying went a bit awkwardly. We, um, well, we're betting in new brakes, new discs. Uh, just wasn't great. I got one flying lap in before I sort of made made some space, and then um, unfortunately I got uh, the auxiliary belt got flung off because the bolt that holds on the auto tensioner well, had gone missing, gone walkies. So that meant the belt was on the piss and it flung itself off over the mountain. And um, yeah, so no power steering, no cooling no charging, nothing. So it got a bit difficult and then I got balked at the end of the uh, after the gooseneck. So it wasn't a great time I put in but amazingly we ended up here. But I think everyone else has had problems. Fiestas I know have had power steering problems as well. <laughs> so here's what it is. Just gotta see what we can do from here. Come on guys, it's getting hot. Yeah, so uh, uh, Josh Lawton with the uh, Black EK, he bought my old gold RGs, he's got it now. He saved the day by coming down and um, tried to invite as many K series owning people as possible. Because then you've got like, a little barrage of spares sitting in the car park. Um, So he very kindly donated me his bolt, and it's worked. Is there a green flag there? Yes, yeah, so I got his his one in my car.
gonna try and get these tyres warm. Just making a break for it. It's gonna be. Our only chance to get away from everyone else. Especially the rear tyres on these, they don't get very warm. We're going to be sitting on the grid for ages. This is a pretty. Pretty fast warm up lap. I don't know if it's um if the track doesn't have much grip, but with a smaller splitter, um got way less front end bite. Especially on the long, long right hander before the gooseneck. This should be an interesting race. Who knows what's going to happen? This guy who's on pole to my left, he actually got, he was like 1.2 seconds faster than me, which is huge. I don't know we had problems, but still. I have no idea, this is the first time I've done like one hot lap around here in this car in the circuit. I don't have a fucking clue what I'm doing. <laughs> So I think we'll settle in, if he can go fast, we'll um, just sit behind him, see if we can get away from some of the other guys who might be a bit faster. So this BMW is going to be quick on a fast line, so we've got to um, close the gap, I think. Never mind that plan. I can see the Fiesta's up to fucking fourth already.
have no idea about breaking points. And I missed one. Oh, just held there. a bit of a gap so not on the grass fucking hell take a bit easier around there next time Oh, that was a bit squirrely, wasn't it? So, to summarise, the new brakes are... They're excellent. Surprised our lap times are so slow. I think I have to say thanks to Luke again for uh, sorting out. He had to go get an orcs belt. Magic one up out of, out of the ether, and um, he got one after a couple tries. There's not many car shops around here. We're a bit in the arse out of nowhere. Anyway, he got one, uh, and eventually, <laughs> off a Ford Fiesta diesel, Fiesta of all things, eh? Two and a half is break. It's a bit safer in it. Whoa, fuck you now. Look at that oil. Oh man, every time, red flag. Oh, come 
come on! Old temp good. Water temp good. There's oil everywhere up there as well. There's so much oil up there. They just laid down a, like two cars worth of oil just before the gooseneck. Oh, coolant. I know. They might not run this anymore, will they? Pardon? Uh, this, uh, this evening. Well, it might be tomorrow now, won't it? <laughs> we got the five o'clock race. Five laps. Um, four laps. Huh. <sighs> well, that's going to ruin my flow a bit, isn't it? So, what can we talk about whilst we're sitting here? I can tell you a joke. It's, um... Probably one of my favourite jokes, I'm just going to steal it from my best mate. Why did the baker have smelly hands? Because he needed a poo. Oh, so childish and brilliant. I think she just wants to touch my car. Yep. I don't go backwards. Oh, creepy, creepy. We're going to take a while to clean up and repair the barrier. So the race before us, we're behind schedule because the race before us, someone went into exactly the same place. It's quite. Um, it's a bit of a, a bit of a bad day for 
Red flags. <sighs> Is that creeper there? I only managed a 140.68. It's not very good. Which means Josh and his rogue... No, I'm not going to talk about it. It just makes me angry. See, now everyone gets a chance to cool off and becomes another three or four lap sprint, which means that anyone who was having tyre issues or brake issues... Um, it's going to be back on it again. Uh, oh, excuse me. <sighs> what have I done since last time I spoke? I've got a smaller sprit spritter. Smaller spritter? I am half Chinese, by the way, so I'm allowed to get away with that. Um, yeah, smaller splitter. Down from 90 mil down to 50 mil. It looks dinky. Um, the balance on the car is probably, actually, I say better, but definitely has less front, tr front traction in the faster corners. Um, oh, ambulance unit reminds me. When I had my big, my big smash here in the metros, my first year recent metros, a brake fail over the mountain section. Uh, so if you go back up, if you go back over my videos, you can probably see it. Um, that put the the willies in me. No, that's probably the wrong thing, isn't it? No willies went in me. Um, up? No, not up. Okay. I'll stop that. Um, yeah, so lost my confidence a bit and then came back two years later and just blitzed the field in the metros. Like 13 seconds, I think, or something. Um, yeah. But what the hell was I talking about? I can't remember. Uh, uh, no. Brain's gone. Brain fade. It's quite amazing what's fast around here, though, actually, because you know, a bit of error seems to help a lot. Oh, the car's coming back. So I just got to wonder how long to repair the barriers. Um, yeah, what else is happening? It's BMW, so they're like the compact shells. Got the M3 engine in, so they're pretty brutish on the straights and usually pretty good in a straight line, like off the, off the start, so I really hope I can hold him up to uh, turn one. Mm. Mm. And there's some like factory clear-cut race cars here, which is uh, where you get the all, all clear-cut series, the X85 chassis or 197-200s to anyone else. And they're like, they're pretty quick, but I think they they don't have much power, but they're sort of their times are sort of hampered by the fact that they're not running slicks like they do in the race series. Um, they're all sequential and hoop de doo. Um, Fiesta's behind me. Oh shit, Fiesta's behind me. I've got to fucking worry about that now. Bollocks. This means they're so shit, I can't even see them sitting right behind me. Um, what else we got? Can't really see. It's hot. Hitting the problem die outside, but uh, they're gonna call it. Are they gonna call it? They're gonna call it. They're gonna call it. They're not gonna call it. Oh, I have to go racing again. So what, what are they <laughs> I always wanna race longer and longer when I'm not in the lead, and then as soon as you get in the lead you're like, yeah, three laps, that's I'll pay a, a hundred quid for per lap to get the win. <laughs> saying that we're a wrong spirit we should be out here racing a camaraderie of going wheel to wheel brakes are good though i'm really surprised by that like they feel loads better weird so the disc went from 282 uh and 23 mil thick so a standard dc2 disc with a twin pot set up well, the twin pots have a really big pad but I think just the discs just get saturated and they can't shed the heat. So we've gone to the um, 300mm by 28 thick disc from the Accord Type R with the, um, 
the monoblocks on and the pad is, I would say the pad is probably in terms of friction area or swept area like at least 30 to 40 percent smaller pad size which is mad so we'll have to see how well how well they they last um, haven't cleaned the car since last time because uh, uh, well lots of things I was just surprised I made it here this weekend my missus got food poisoning she got that on oh crap what day was it Thursday and um, she lost four pounds in one day and uh, yeah that's a lot of poop and vomit so she she still braved it and we we drove up here and the, the drive took seven and a half hours I got it wrong on Instagram but seven and a half hour tow to the 210 odd miles pathetic we can't do shit in the UK when it comes to driving on the roads. I mean, the, the fucking M25 is five lanes wide, but you get fucking dick face McBall bag sitting in lanes four and five, and then two and three are completely empty. And it's like, what the fuck are you doing? You're not meant to undertake, so it makes, you know, you end up doing undertakes and shit like that. And, but just fuck it up, because effect effectively the, the motorway goes, you know, like 60% smaller because you're just cutting off half the lanes because you can't undertake them. You just sit there like a bunch of fucking dickheads. Sort yourself out, England. Everyone will get around a lot quicker. And whomever, I hope he watches this, I doubt he will, but someone Ford knows him and falls on. Whoever was in charge of the planning project for the Dartford tolls and the new tunnel system and getting rid of the toll booths. We got rid of like, God, there were loads of them. There must have been like 18 toll booths or something like that. And now we've gone down to this automated camera system. The fucking traffic is twice as bad. You cannot get through it. Love nor money. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Three minutes. Uh, yeah, so whoever did the planning on that fucking Dartford toll. Let turn. Needs a right kick in the bollocks. He fucked that up royally. And they charge you for it. You sit in traffic. Like, minimum traffic's half an hour. Maximum, maybe three hours. And you sit in it like a fucking mug, waiting to pay your fucking money to go through a fucking shitty tunnel. And there's no other way across. There's no... I mean, there's some crap ferries and stuff. There's no other bridge, no other tunnel. It's just fucking a joke. And living in the south of the M25, like, you know, that's it. I, I have to go that way or Heathrow. Fucked in the butt when it comes to getting getting to races. My record still stands from getting from basically Brighton to um where was it? Castle Coop, nine hours. It's like 160 miles, nine hours. If there's anything else you'd like me to whine about, just let me know. Or I could tell a, I could tell more jokes, but I'm gonna have to go study them. I don't really remember that many jokes. Um what else we got? I'm actually recording. Oh, yep, okay, I'm recording. Thank God for that. Hello, hello. Okay. <sighs> one green flag lap, then three minutes plus one lap, so it's going to be maybe two or three laps if we're lucky. The line's going to completely change into the uh, goose deck now. So I don't know how slow it's going to be, how dangerous it's going to be. Uh, I'll just have a normal race. we got another race at 5 o'clock, I don't even know we're going to have that. Because it's... Like 1... 1.45 now or something stupid. Uh. Are we going? So I'm sitting here getting hot. Oh, he's reaching for something. Oh, it's a one minute board. One minute. Thirty 
three seconds, mate. Oh, my mouth is so dry. Green flag, left. Let's get this done quickly, guys. There'll be other people who want to race, so we best get this shit done quick. Oh, well, we're loose on the rear again. I am leaving sixth to keep the RPM low and try to cool down the rad. Not the rad, the engine. Wait, let's cool down the engine a bit. This car does grip like buggery. Oil around here? Oh no. There we go. That's ruined the line, hasn't it? Let's get some of this shit out of there. There, uh, take that! Dust! Dust in your face! Oh, does it make it slippery? It should make everyone on the green flag lap, it should make everyone run over it. I think we got another red flag. I think they got. Oh no, I think Alistair Camp went up behind me. I think I closed the door on him. Oh no! Oh fuck. That was probably my fault. Apologize my fucking ass off to Alistair there. Can I even do 
look on up there. Matey, you can do it. You can do it. There you go. Let's go. Alright, I gotta run and apologise to him. See, this is how he's doing.